Let me know whether I should set a YouTube channel up about how to eat healthily. Here you have some chicken and curly fries made from salad. What's up guys, welcome to a daily vlog and a ridiculous haircut. I've just got out of the shower so it's slightly um, all over the place. Um, but today, guess where I am? Video editing in the morning. The guys at SB are up at Silverstone for a Ferrari race day. However, I'm gonna go over there and um, use their parking spaces for my car. You'll see why in a bit. Super exciting. Not sure what you're gonna think of it, but um, I can't wait to get this started. So um, let's get cracking on the video. Two videos to film. I've got two videos coming out. I'm trying to work out when they're gonna come out. Anyway, I'm filming a lot and recording a lot which is the same thing, but I'm also editing a lot. So there's gonna be lots of videos coming out this weekend, which I can't wait for you to see. <sighs> right, finally, I'm on route and I feel like I'm shouting because this car's being really shouty this morning on cold. Anyway, I've got some really exciting news that I wanna share with you. Now, Goodwood Festival of Speed is coming next week from Thursday to Sunday and I'm going to be there Friday, Saturday and Sunday to answer uh, the questions that have been on Twitter and Instagram whether I'm going to be there or not. I'm going Friday, Saturday and Sunday and I'm going to be there with Audi UK. The exciting thing is there's a Supercars of London competition happening right now and you can enter right now and it's going out here, Twitter and Instagram. All you have to do is take the most creative selfie involving an Audi. That might seem quite a strange competition, but the idea is behind the Vorsprung Dirk Technique slogan that the Audi have, which is all about creative and forward innovative thinking. How you enter the competition, you take the selfie, you upload it to Instagram or Twitter, you tag in the handle Audi UK, and you also hashtag Supercars of London. That way it goes into the right pool, you're tagging the right person, but also the hashtag means that I'm able to find all of the entrants. The competition is open right now and it will end Monday midnight that goes over to Tuesday. And then I will be announcing the winner in the Wednesday vlog because I filmed Tuesday and then we'll upload it on the Wednesday. So on the Wednesday vlog, the winner will be announced and throughout this video, I'm gonna be telling you what is involved in the prize, including tickets to Goodwood, into the Audi VIP stand and lots more goodies. I'm on route to SB Race Engineering now, so that is the competition launched. Right, so what we need it's a microfiber cloth. Now I have no idea how this is gonna go. I've de-wrapped my uh, two previous wraps on the car and it took over two days. So I have no idea how long this is gonna take, how easy it is to peel off. I know that once you start getting that peel, it is a relatively easy to get off. Um, so we're just gonna give it a go, see how we get on. 100% I'm not gonna finish it today. It's just, um, just coming up to one o'clock and I haven't had lunch. So <laughs> let's go. Oh, oh, almost had it. Check this out. Well, this is much easier than a vinyl wrap. This is so much easier. I'm doing it one hand. And back comes the silver, as simple as that.
the best thing ever. So my hands are filthy. We're 45 minutes in. That's how much has come off my car. And we're pretty much silver on one side. Apart from the roof. Right, so now I need you guys to see the back. I might stick you on Stuart's car whilst he's up at Silverstone, reverse the car back so we get a good angle, and then time lapse. So we have the door, this front triangle there, the rear skirt, and that bit to do. And I'm going to try and show you how easy it is to do the door. I just need to find a place to stick you on. It's better. So you get your microfiber cloth and basically you just start rubbing at the edges like on the doors. Stew soon starts to peel and it is literally as simple as that. Right, this is the progress. Grey back bumper, and then silver down the sides. And annoyingly, this is how I'm gonna have to leave it for now, until I get some double-sided sticky tape, and I know that I can put my rear bumper back on, uh, rear number plate back on the car. I think it looks quite awesome in the metallic silver with the lime green bit. Yeah, the back of the car is grey because I haven't got double-sided tape to take off the um, back number plate, take off the grey and then put back on the number plate. So I'm going to have to wait until um, that happens. This has been a whole lot of use. I've stuck it to the window over there. I've stuck it to Stuart's car without him knowing and I've been able to get some really cool angles, hopefully. So now I'm going to stick it back up on my windscreen where it belongs. Let me tell you about what is included in the Goodwood competition. So like I said earlier in the vlog, you have to upload the most creative selfie that you can think of to Instagram or Twitter, tagging Audi UK and hashtagging Supercars of London. And the prize, the Goodwood Festival of Speed prize, is the following. You win a pair of tickets to the Sunday Goodwood Festival of Speed, which is by far the flagship day that you want to be going. The moving motor show is amazing. You got the likes of the P1 GTR, the new McLaren 570S. I think the Ferrari 488 GTB is also going up. It is basically a hill climb, it's so cool. All of the major manufacturers have stands. You also win a Goodwood picnic lunch, which, I mean, it feeds you, it's free. I'd take it. And you also get access to the Audi VIP stand, which is gonna be awesome. Normally, you need to own an Audi, I think, and show your Audi key to get into the VIP stand which overlooks pretty much the whole of Goodwood and is usually opposite the Goodwood house. It's a fantastic view and I'm gonna be there on Sunday. I'm probably gonna be in the Audi VIP section for a little bit of it, which um, if you're there and whoever wins, I will come and say hi and uh, we can chill out for a little bit, but I don't know what I'm actually doing on the Sunday. I also don't really know what I'm doing now with this manoeuvre. Right, I've got to be super quick. Let me know if any of you do this. Right, so I've been at home for about an hour and you know how I said that I was like quite hungry, moderately hungry, very hungry. 
So I decide, you know what, whilst the oven is warming up, get the chicken out, and then I might just play a little bit of Xbox. Um, yeah, I ended up doing qualifying a race, which takes about 40 minutes on the game because you do 25% of the actual race. And then I did another qualifying, so I had a new season, I'm a new season now, so I've gone up um, the difficulty, and I've also changed to Mercedes AMG in, this, in Formula 1 2013, if you're, if you're new to the daily vlogs. Oven has been preheating for about an hour now, so I'd shove the chicken in, set the timer to like 15 minutes, so that it can be the perfect time before I stick the curly fries in. It's a really healthy lunch, this gonna go to the gym later on I promise um, and now I've given myself 15 minutes to go down to the shop and replenish the supply of drinks that I um, somehow demolished yesterday and the day before so I'm now rushing for my dinner even though I was an hour or whatever on the Xbox whilst the oven was preheated. Let me know whether you do anything similar to that, whether, you're going, whether you've got your priorities wrong when it comes to food, gaming, or just whatever you want to do anyway. I've made it, how long have I got left? No way. One minute. My chicken's in there. Let me know whether I should set a YouTube channel up about how to eat healthily. Here you have some chicken and curly fries made from salad. Lunch finished, I'm now back upstairs. Idea is, I've got two videos to film. I didn't realize that because I'm not gonna be around this weekend on my laptop that I need to get all of the videos ready for the weekend. So I've already edited two. I've still got the Top Gear Substitution video to edit, but I've also got this daily vlog to edit. So after I've finished editing these videos, I'm gonna sign off so that I can get this video onto YouTube so that whilst I am away from my laptop, I'm So I'm currently editing the Top Gear Substitution video that features the Alfa Romeo 4C. And this clip is just it starting up, but I'm gonna leave it at that. You can see the reflection in the window. Window, screen, hello. And uh, yeah, basically the idea is we do a 4C review. Right, ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of the vlog. How weird is it that I'm ending the vlog where I normally start the vlog? Anyway, my phone is going mad. I'm going to turn it on silent. And I'm halfway through editing the videos, which is um, painful at six o'clock in the evening. But it's got to be done so that I can chill out this weekend. I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend and enjoy the Supercars of London content that is coming throughout the weekend. I'm going to just chill out, relax, and um, yeah. Probably watch back a few of the vlogs because it's been a fantastic week, but I need to get these videos uploaded onto the computer, edited and online for you guys to enjoy. Thanks for watching and I will see you tomorrow for Supercars of London. <laughs> you can have a bit of a joke about that. <laughs>